Concentric and equal constraints. I can place cons uh, equal constraints to say one thing is equal to the other. And we go up to the parametric and we're going to go to the equal sign and go to equal and we'll select this object to this object. And now those two things are the same. So if I, if I were to change the size, they both change. Okay. So um, now I can also do multiple equals. So uh, so I hit the equals, and then down here, if I hit M for multiple, now I select the first object and the second object and the third object and the fourth object, etc. And now when I change the diameter, they all can change. So I can have multiple things all equal. So for example, if all the bolts are going to change, all the holes would change. Okay. Likewise, we can do concentric. And concentric when the meaning of concentric is they share the same center point of the circle or an arc can be concentric as well. So, we're going to go up and select the concentric constraint and I'm going to select the first object, the inside one. I'm going to select the second one, the outside one. Now they're both the same. As I go and change them, it keeps the same center point. Just changing the diameter doesn't do that. However, if I go and do the move command and I want to move one of them, they both move because they both will share the same center point. So it's a uh, making sure that we use the same concentric center point uh, for the concentric constraint.